Hey everybody, what's going on? Jamil the Killer here, and I'm back with some more Madden Ultimate Team. Um, this is just kind of another run updated video. I do have some gameplay to put up, but I am trying to edit that down now. I've got about four or five different games that I don't remember what happened, uh, so I'm going back and rewatching them, and hopefully I'll get that up for you guys here soon. Um, let's go take a look at the collections here, new stuff they released, uh, the Jeans Upshot collection. Uh, gives you his two card, takes his 99, 92, 99 John Madden, 97 Gene Upshaw, and Tom Flores, the key card. So, uh, right off the bat, this is probably not a collection I'm going to do, because his key card is going to be put up for more than he's worth, probably, most likely. So my plan is to sell his one star, which is probably going to be... I could probably get 50,000 for it right now. Cheapest is 54. So I'm going to sell that and I'm going to sell each of those other ones. And I've got um, two 97s and three 92s, I think. So something like that. Um, and then with that money, I that should probably be enough to buy them outright. Um, probably by next week. Because um, right now the only one up on the block is 500,000 coins. Not worth it. So yeah. And I'll show you his card in a second here just so you can see his stats. And the coin up swap. Um, I have not done mine yet, but I'm not really sure I'm going to go with. Um, it's good. It's either between Eli Manning or, Col or LaShawn McCoy, and they, I think they changed it to 750 coins per touchdown from Eli and 1,000 coins per touchdown from McCoy. So I don't know who, who do you guys think is going to do it. I'm probably going to go with Manning, but, you know, that's it. Uh, they do have new warm-ups. Uh, this is for you know, people just starting out that don't have much cards. These consist of all uh, lower bronze and maybe a silver. I think it's mostly bronze, um, just to get you some coins, things like that. Um, and then they also have... I don't think they've released anything else besides the week. Oh, oh my mic! Oh, gee! Yeah. Alright. Okay. 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 Uh, no, that was about it. Uh, there's the fantasy. Week 3 Premium, I never did that. I did pull a Ben Roethlisberger, but nothing else, so. That's that. They are going to be releasing today, yes, Week 4 matchup. Um, not really worth the coins, so that's that. Um, that's basically all the collections they've released so far. And let's go take a look at some of the new cards I've got. I haven't gotten anything really new, except for I kind of went on a spending, I guess you could call it a spree. It only cost me like 75,000 coins for the two of them. I bought two more Tory Smith cards. Um, my other one's up on the trade block. See what people offer me. Haven't really got offered anything. So I have three Tory Smiths. Um, thinking about possibly doing a giveaway eventually. I think maybe 100 subs. Um, or I might hold off until 2, 250, so there's more people to be involved. I don't know. Um, and I've been thinking, uh, I'm gonna try, try to get in touch with SGU and see if maybe they can, I can join them on a stream, you know, for a little bit, you know, Skype them or something. Cause that'd be pretty awesome. Uh, if you're watching this, not as fan, you know, I'll hook you up in the stream again, no problem. Need some coins after you fail. I don't know if you failed completely out out of now, but yeah. Um, this is kind of awkward. Anyway, uh, yeah, you see, we got my Randall Cobb and Don Driver. Uh, otherwise, I didn't get anything new. I thought about trying to sell Chris Clemens off, but I'm going to keep him for a while. He's probably going to have to keep him for quite a while before they're going to go up because they're sitting steady around 35, 40,000 coins apiece. Um, oh, right there. As you can see, beginner pack. They uh, also incorporated this for starters to try to kind of boost your team to give you 25 silver cards for 15,000 coins. Um, again, just for kind of starters get your team a little extra boost so you can start winning some games and yeah let's go take a look at the two star gene upshot card he's right here on the on the block oh where is he and i think he i, think I, I just checked i think he's 500,000 coins so yeah not really worth it right here gene upshot two star got amazing stats so he's probably gonna probably the best left guard in the game uh, best lineman in the game, I'm gonna say. So, and he gives plus one to ball carry revision, so that's good. 
Um, other than that, that's not a whole lot left to cover of new stuff they released. Uh, I just wanted to take this time to answer a couple questions. Um, again, I get this question every time from someone, whether it's in the comments or on Xbox. Um, how did you get so many coins? I've said it in every video. I just worked the auction house. Buy cards low, sell them high. Um, was it this guy? Best way to earn coins. But every video I've said it in. Um, I saw your video. How'd you get all these coins? Auction house. I'm um, just said so. And Dougie Fresh thinks it was a glitch, but it wasn't. So, yeah. I know there are glitches out there, but I'm not a fan of it, so that's that. Uh, let's go check my trade block. I got one to offer, and I think it was AJ Green. I should totally take it and make that guy's day. So, yeah, you know. I don't know. So, I, I don't know. We're up to about six minutes. I'm not a fan of like really short videos, so let's go search the auction house, see if we can find some steals here. Uh, go through some legendary corners. Oops. See if I can find a Dion. Dion's been pretty steady at 190, even 175, but I don't want to buy him for 175, so yeah. 169. I bet I can make a profit on him. 159? Yeah, I'll buy him. Alright. Buy him out. And I'm gonna just gonna throw him up for 175,000. And I bet you he will sell eventually. Because that one for 174 is going to go out. The one for 169 is going to go out. And that'll be a small profit. Nothing big. So, And if he does sell, or when he does, when, whichever, um, I will let you guys know and show you that. And show you that's that's how I've been making profits. You just, whoop, no, 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 no. You just gotta know uh, what the cards go for usually, and just keep your eye out because eventually you'll see them. Like uh, every now and then, I've seen a few legendary, like one star, two star cards going for 150 coins because the person messed up, and I have not been able to get many. I've gotten a few. Um, I would love to get some of the ones I've seen, but no, there was a guy up on the forums. He got a two star Steve Young for like 200 coins. That would be amazing. I would love that. Um, let's go check out some Patrick Willis's. I know their prices jumped pretty high. I bought, well, I bought one for like 30000 and then a couple days later he jumped up back to eighty, which is kind of ridiculous. Cajun Beast! Uh, what do we got? Yeah, 82000 Jesus. Oof. That's a little too rich for me. Just kidding. No, it's not. But... Yeah, let's go check some... Let's check the Elite cards. I haven't seen... I haven't checked this for a while since I sold my Patrick Willis. I know there's not many Willis's up on the block anymore. kind of wish I would have kept mine, actually. I sold mine for 620000 and then, like a week later, this one guy ended up doing a deal for... He sold his for a two-star Dion and 750,000 coins. So he almost got a million coins out of his, which is kind of ridiculous. Oh, is there even one on the block? Yep. 1,511,000. Yes. Yes, yes. He's the only one really worth it to me. I mean, I'm not a fan of any of the others just because he has the, the beastly stats of 100 on tackle and hit power. So, here's that. Uh, pushing nine minutes here, so I'm probably going to cut this off quick. Just check a couple more. A couple more legendary cards that I usually try to get. Uh, Walter Payton, he usually goes steady for about 45, 50,000. Um, yeah, where are we at here? Yeah, 62. There was a while there where someone tried to price fix them. They bought them all out, put them all up. Or no, he didn't even put them up. They just took them all down. So I threw mine up for 75,000 just to see. And he sold. And I was like, oh, all right. And then shortly after, they all came back up for like 50 and 40, and the guy was probably pretty angry, but... Yeah, I'm just saving my 299 versions for this his one star, so... That's that's kind of what I'm thinking. Um, I think I'm just going to stick with that. I got, I got this, this message. Uh, that's it for this video, guys. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this just a quick update. Um, if you did, comment, tell me, subscribe, you know, is what it is. Um, look for some another video... 
I might try to put one up tomorrow. I don't know. Talking about NFL, maybe I'll do picks or something. I don't know. Um, but that's it for me today. If you like the video, comment and subscribe. And I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching.